What is going on people welcome back to another video on aj5 and in today's video guys we do have this crypto called bnt also known as bank or network which has pumped up a massive 35 percent in the last 24 hours and currently trading at 48 cents so we're going to be looking at is this a crypto to be worth investing into is it worth investing into it is it too late if you're on a profit should you sell it or is it simply time to hold on to it that's what we're going to be going through in today's video and looking at its prediction over the next couple of hours days weeks months and overall in 2023 how high can bank or go or how low can it go and is it worth investing into over the short term and long term as well and looking at its prediction over the next couple of weeks months and so on but before i get into all of that stuff guys if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet make sure to go down and smash the subscribe button as well as like the video as i am trying to hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target i'll be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry follow me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so we are currently on the coinbase website as you can clearly see the market is down 0.14 percent nothing major and we do have bank or network token as the top gainer in the last 24 hours so in the last hour itself it managed to gain a massive 11 percent in a single hour which is absolutely crazy over the last day 35 percent it all started up as you can see later on this afternoon and it's still ongoing right now over the week 28 percent and over the month 23 percent up so going into the coin market cap website here we can see the trading volume has gone up over three thousand percent making it 47 million dollars in trading which is a huge percentage increase of course that was expected because it pumped up out of nowhere and it's still ongoing so more and more people are looking to trade the crypto more buyers more sellers and in general just a lot of people trading it as it is getting a lot of attention and a lot of hype around it meaning more and more people are going to be looking into the project and trade it as well so on the screen right now we do have the candlestick pattern chart with the fibonacci scale which i'm going to be using later on in the video to do some technical analysis but for now i'm just going to hide this and i'm going to bring out the usual macd indicator to do some price prediction as i'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for so i am currently looking at the daily chart and at the top here we've got the purple line running across the chart which is the sma indicator giving us the average value of banco which is here at 39 cents however it is actually trading at a much higher value here in green at 48 cents nearly 49 cents meaning it's performing quite well and much better than expected so let's zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short term traders and then i'll move on to the hourly daily and weekly chart for the long term investors like myself but before i do that guys just a little disclaimer as usual this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor anything i say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make i will not be responsible for so zooming into the 30 minute chart we do have the blue and the orange line looking quite bullish heading towards a positive direction meaning increases in value are expected however it is looking very steep guys meaning it's not realistic and as i've mentioned plenty of times before whenever you see a macd indicator looking this steep either going in a bullish or bearish direction that means it's not realistic and the exact same applies to bank call right now so guys over the next 12 to 14 hours so let's say by in the early hours of tomorrow to tomorrow midday i am expecting an overall drop in value from bnt potentially trading around 42 to 43 cents is where i'm expecting bnt to be trading at by midday tomorrow so guys do expect an overall drop in value but again doesn't mean it's going to start dropping as of right now it's likely to pump up a little bit higher up to about 43 sorry 53 54 cents before it slowly starts to drop back down in value later on today and in the early hours of tomorrow moving on to the hourly chart similar to the previous chart we still got the blue and the orange line looking very bullish very steep meaning once again it's not realistic so over the next seven to eight days guys towards the end of next week i am expecting banco to be more or less trading at a slightly lower value than where it is at the moment potentially around 45 cents is where i'm expecting banco to be trading at towards the end of next week however this depends on how the crypto market performs as well as any updates or news that come across from bnt itself but again at the moment it is looking quite negative over the next week but again that doesn't mean it's going to be consistently hitting red days for the next seven eight days of course not 
he is likely to hit green days in between as well up and down but it just means the red days are going to overtake the green days meaning an overall drop in value is is expected moving on to the daily chart next couple of weeks we've still got the blue line looking very steep heading towards the bullish direction however the orange line is looking a little bit much more realistic than the previous two charts so yes guys in this case i'm expecting an overall increase in value from bnt over the next six to eight weeks so late september early october 2023 we should see bnt trading over the one dollar mark again this would only happen if the crypto market manages to stay on the green side and goes towards the bullish direction and mainly bitcoin i'm expecting it to hover over 40 sorry not 40 35 000 and if that is the case we should see more and more cryptos heading towards the bullish direction including banco as well so potentially heading around one dollar mark is what i'm expecting by september to october time but again you guys have to bear in mind it is cryptocurrency it is a very volatile market any little news can have a major impact on any cryptocurrencies out there so make sure you guys stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time i upload as i will be uploading daily to keep you guys updated on the crypto market what to expect what to predict and so on so let's get rid of the macd indicator and bring on the fibonacci scale to do some technical analysis as you guys can see there isn't much to do here only because not only are we trading in the red zone but we are in the lowest part of the red zone and we have been trading in the red zone for nearly two years guys so since november 2021 we've been trading in the red zone and over time we've been getting worse and worse and worse and for us to hit the green zone we're gonna have to hit three dollars and 42 cents which i'm not expecting from banco anytime soon so more or less guys we are going to be tr stuck in the red zone at least for the next 12 to 18 months but again that doesn't matter as long as we slowly and steadily start to move in a positive direction we should be good to go but yeah this is my take and my predictions on bnt guys let me know what are you guys doing right now are you guys buying it are you guys selling it or are you guys simply holding on to it comment down below as i'm very intrigued to see how many of you guys are bullish and how many of you guys are bearish on this crypto and also let me know your predictions what is the highest figure of this crypto can hit in 2023 let me know in the comment section down below as well but yeah that is pretty much it for today's video guys just a quick one on bnt i hope you enjoyed the video if you did make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video and also guys i am trying to hit 100k by the end of the year so it'd mean a lot if you guys could go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video as i am trying to hit 100k subscribers and at the end of the day guys it's free to subscribe so why don't you go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video and i catch all of you guys in my next crypto update which should hopefully be later on today or tomorrow until then take care and peace.